So I ordered some poppies for the veterans. This is all going into the grove. Uh, I think it would be a beautiful thing. I also ordered some white grandfather sage because I use it a lot and do different things. And then I ordered these vines uh, to go around the fence just because I think they look cool. Hello everybody, how you going? <coughs> so I rolled here this morning and I snipped off all the dead leaves and stuff off the raspberries bushes and uh, some of them are actually looking pretty good now so even this one looks really bad <laughs> and then uh, this one's got a couple of new green leaves on it and this one's going pretty good so just goes to show you if you leave them long enough and you help them a little bit what you can and uh, the blueberries are all looking good every one of the blueberries are doing good so that's pretty cool anyway I was just piddling around with this so I thought I'd show you oh boy look at this look at all the new green leaves this is Shelly's plant look at I uh, gave it uh, boiled sage water and tea a couple of times and it looks like it's really starting to pick up nice. So we'll keep doing that and see what happens. But that should do the trick. But yeah, I mean, it's looking a hell of a lot better. I think we got her. Ah. Okay, look at that. It's the other tree of life. It's getting nice and green and these ones here it's really weird because these ones here were very brittle but look how soft they are look at that all soft and, and movable so and lots lots and lots of green pop look down there lots of new green leaves coming up Look at that, Sherry. Your tree's doing wonderfully. We'll give it some more sage water and tea, and she should be fine. And then look at your other tree, Sherry. Beautiful. Just growing. Look at the swirl. Look at it. You can't ask for better than that for a globe tree. And same with Drew's. I mean, holy crap, look at it. See the swirl right in the center? That's a perfect tree. And there's timbers. Doing good. Look how much your little witch tree's grown. It's grown about four inches, I bet you. That witch tree's gonna... I, I still can't believe I thought that thing was a piece of dead crap. But it's, it's doing good. And Angela's tree's doing lovely as usual. Now remember we were looking at your leaves yesterday? Look at how look how nice they are after the rain. Look at that. So your tree's back to normal, Angela. And there's the tree. Uh, Drew's lilac. Now these lilacs are different than all the other ones in the yard. Uh, these ones are not bush lilacs. These are tree lilacs. So in other words, they won't spread all over the place. Um, and if I'm not mistaken, they're gonna have pink and white uh, on them, if I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong, but... So don't quote me on it, but I think we're gonna have pink and, and purple uh, mixture trees there. Okay, this one over here... Uh, we got one for Julie. One for Lori, one for wait, no, that one's no Julie, yeah, Julie, Lori, um, oh, I'm out of brain for it. Anyway, I think there's only this one left uh, to be claimed. 
But that might even be claimed too. I have to double check. I wrote it down in the house. So many trees and so many people, I can't remember them all. Uh, I don't know. But that one's spoken for too. That's the only one left. As far as I remember. But, yeah, I can't. You know, we're at like 40 trees. So, <laughs> trying to remember them without any help is hard. Yeah, they're all doing real nice. I think I think the grill is going to be beautiful once it's once they start growing. Well, and I ordered some more stuff. Um, <clears throat> the first thing I ordered is uh, Flanders poppies uh, for the military. just got the seeds though so I'm gonna plant them from grandfather and I'll plant them over here to here with the poppies and then uh, I'm gonna grow some more sage so I'll run the sage from here to Drew's and then I got some uh, celebration vine that I'm going to start along this fence and basically uh, they'll grow up and they'll have great big huge flowers on them all different colors like every color in a rainbow uh, rainbow vine it's going to go all the way across to about here I don't want to go past the tree of life with it so I think we'll go to here and then those vines I'm going to move a few of them this way And I think we're going to let the Smokies take over this side of the fence. <laughs> smoke, smoke trees. So, anyway, we'll see as it goes. Hello, everybody. Say hi, Jesse. Hi. Are we chillaxing? Yeah. Tell, tell them. We're relaxing. We're relaxing, yeah. And so's Luna, see? We're just chilling in the groove. Look at that. Chillaxing. Well, so that's what we're doing. I got to get the weed whacker out and do the grass a little bit and I got to do some weeding today. So I'll show you that later. And yeah, so anyway, just wanted to say I think I'm going to have to get Drew to get her ass over here and help me with all this weeding stuff. That's a good idea. So if I got Drew over here to do the weeding and help me with the weeding and I got Sherry over here to help me with the stuff and... Then we get all three to do the prayer. Oh yeah, see, I got a good plan now. <laughs> I have to excuse my slow movement today. I had a really bad fall last night and hurt myself a little bit. But I'm in here getting rejuvenated. So, uh, some news about the grove itself. Update. Uh, White Owl is... Uh, Marked down and registered with the registry for being an assistant of mine for the Grove. Uh, so she's officially uh, been written in as an assistant. Of course, so is so is George. So is Blaine, of course. Uh, but with every Grove, you need a council of five. So that's me, huh. White Owl, and Georgie. So, later on today, Sherry, my dear, you're going to be registered as the Witch of the Grove and the Druid and the Spirit Walker, like your dad. And Drew, you are also going to be registered as a White Witch uh, in, char in charge with the Grove and, um, yeah. So, that'll be the Council of Five, uh, what is needed for the registry, and uh, yeah, so I just thought I'd share that with you. Uh, White Owl, Georgie, Sherry, Andrew, and myself are the Council of Five for this grove. 
everyone else who has uh, <coughs> has a tree in here has been marked down and written. It's also on the registry that you own a tree in the grove. So if you ever ask, do you belong to a grove? Yes, you do. <laughs> so everybody else is who has a tree uh, is also part of the Canadian grove. All right. So just so you know. Um, yeah, and of course, anyone who who's always um, commenting and on the site with the grove and everything, this is your grove as well. So, but um, yeah, so anyone who has a tree uh, is registered as a contributor to the grove and a, a follower of the grove. Okay, so if you if you bought a tree or if you have a tree in the grove, you're you're, you're registered as a as a contributor to the grove and uh, yeah so I just wanted to share that with you I thought that would be some happy news for some people and that's it so we shall talk to you in a bit okay I've decided that I'm giving this tree to my niece Amabel Liz um, she needs a tree because I want to put her on register as a demonologist because uh, every grove needs a demonologist <laughs> 